Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Bashed Helmet Farm on Elliot's birthday, apparently. I'm gonna have to bring him something. Ugh, God, I don't even like that guy. How are you guys all doing? I am doing pretty great. I'm hoping for rain tomorrow. Give me rain. Clear and sunny all day. Nope, no rain, which means no watering can upgrade. Unfortunately, not yet. Well, we'll have to survive somehow, won't we? So, it is Friday the 5th of fall. Throw my fishing pole in here. Uh, I am going to take this stuff because we are going to head up the mountain today. And in fact, I'm going to go ahead before I even go water the crops and just make sure I have everything I need. I'll, I'll, I'll come back and check after. I, I tend to forget things, friends. You know? Oh, are these ready already? Hold on a sec. I know that they grow quick. Oh, I, I don't think so. They would have a little plus sign over them right now. Okay. Not ready yet. Almost ready, but not quite. So, we don't have too much watering to do, thanks to these wonderful, wonderful sprinklers that I love, as I'm sure you know. But today, I've been thinking... Are these full? Are they both full? I hope so. It's so hard to tell. There should be, like, a different, uh... Different image or something. Well, anyway. Well, anyway... I've got my baby chicken over there that I need to go and take care of. And then I think we'll pretty much be ready to head up the mountain to... Oh, corn. I'll take that, thank you. Um, I'm gonna upgrade the coop. I thought about should I build a barn first or should I upgrade the coop first? And I've decided if I want to build the barn, I'm gonna have to clear out an area for the barn. It's actually more work. However, if I just upgrade the coop, we can still get a new animal. I think we get ducks after our first upgrade. Oops, I, I used the wrong mouse button there. There's some food for you, and you can also come outside and find some food for yourself if you want to, little guy. There he is! Or she, I suppose it's gotta be a she, right? Because she's gonna lay eggs later. I hope some of this grass has spread so she can eat. But if not, that's all right. By the way, eventually, I know this, this area is too small for a pasture for all the animals, so I will uh, eventually clear out this area down here and build a fence so that all the animals will be able to go down there for food. However, not today. Today's not the day for that. Right now, we need to collect this very important rock, put this very important stick into the machine, and I'm gonna sell these. Okay, what I need. I need, well, I don't need this, and I don't need this, so let's, let's, uh, like that, I think is good. And we need 400 wood and 150 stone. Boom. 400 wood, 150 stone. I don't want any extras. I'm also going to take, I don't know what Elliot likes. I think I'll probably just give him a blueberry. Blueberries usually work. Most people like blueberries, I think. We'll find out. Maybe he doesn't. Maybe he hates blueberries. He's like that, you know? Sell those. Stick that over here. This is a reminder that we need to go and sell things to the Adventurer's Guild. And did I pet Meep yet? I don't remember. I need to check those mushrooms, too. Probably don't check the mushrooms often enough in my cave. There you go, Meep. Good morning. I love you, too. I do I love that guy. He's the best. Real life meat doesn't look like him. I don't know if I've mentioned that. You probably already know that from other other series and other videos. Real life meat is a black kitty. He's all black. His paws are black. Even the, his toe pads are black. The only part of him that is not black is he's got a little tiny patch of white on his neck. Like a little bow tie. He's very cute. Very cute. Sell all those mushrooms. We don't need that that bit of uh, plant fiber either. I can leave, we can leave here. Okay, I think we're ready. I think we're ready to head up the mountain. And I'm gonna go, really? Really? Fine. Is there anything else that we need to process? Yeah, we got some more broken CDs. And actually, that's reasonably important. There. Because uh, the CDs give us that delicious, delicious quartz, which we love so much. So, I'm gonna go ahead up to the carpenter. We're gonna ask Robin to improve this coop already. Even though she just built it for us, we, we want a bigger and a better one, and we want some more animals. So we're gonna do that. 
Hello, Robin. I didn't have a nice walk because I rode BMO. Have you met the wild man that lives behind our house? I guess I don't really mind as long as he doesn't bother us. He's a nice guy. Be nice to him, eh? It's a present for you, even though you're you're being mean. Uh, construct farm buildings. I would like a bigger coop, please. Big coop. 10,000 gold. 400 wood. 150 stone. Let's build this sucker. Let's put this right uh, here. On top of this one. Awesome. Thank you very much, Robin. Start working on it first thing tomorrow morning. Then maybe after that, we can... Uh, possibly... I'm not gonna read all this, guys. I just, I just want to make friends with everyone. I always forget. Blah, blah, blah. Hope everyone stays healthy. Thanks. Well, she's not a huge fan of the blueberries, is she? Fine. That's fine. Whatever. That's her business. Oh, I'm seeing forage around as well. I always gotta grab the forage. It's seasonal. You gotta get it while you can. You can't just walk around and get hazelnuts all year. Oh, no, you cannot. Only during the fall. Alright, so yes, as you probably guessed, I am going to head up here to the mines after I go and sell my junk. I almost forgot again. Did you, did you notice that I almost forgot? Oh, it's not up until 2pm. Okay. So I have to remember to come back over here after I finish mining. Now, I'm going to floor 70. Because between floors 70 and 79, we've got all that delicious iron. And that is what I'm mining for today. We're not short on iron, but we don't have as much as I would like to have. It's something that we need more of. I also want to dig four. There we go. As demonstrated here. Oh, there's not as much ground to hoe there as it looks like there is. Okay, never mind. But we do have a gas tier. Sorry, frozen tier. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Somebody told me that it is possible to find stuff by breaking these crystals. I have never found anything, and I suspect it may be one of those myths. Maybe somebody is playing a little trick on Ira. But I'm gonna check anyway. They are fun to break. Even if they don't give you anything. I guess that's it. Okay, down we go. I see a skeleton here. Let's go kill it. And it's dead. Ching! Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, so the Adventurer's Guild opens at 2pm. We're not just gonna mine today. I also want to go fishing. I do want to see if we can get one of those sea cucumbers, but that doesn't come out till the evening. Come here, skeleton friend. I'm just kidding, you're not my friend. I was playing ya. Uh. Oh! Here I am waiting for it to go a little further, and it's not gonna because we haven't upgraded this any further yet. We need to do that. Goodness. Way behind on upgrading the tools. And you know what? The hoe? We don't need a rainy day to upgrade the hoe. We can upgrade the hoe anytime. We should do that soon. Oh, I got thermal boots. Another thing to sell. Pretty sure my boots are better than that. They are space boots. So, yeah. Pretty much better than the thermal boots. Thermal boots are nice and fuzzy. They're basically Uggs, I think. Oh look, it's a bat. Come here, frozen bat. Come on, take your time, why don't you? There we go. Getting some quartz. Quartz always good. We give quartz as gifts. And we can refine it into refined quartz, but honestly, I don't think it's usually necessary. Because we get enough quartz from fishing, from the CDs and the... Uh, Conspiracy glasses, which for some reason are made out of quartz. Who knew? Did you guys know the glasses are made of quartz? I didn't know that. This game taught- this game teaches me so much. It teaches us so much, you guys. It's wonderful. It's very quiet down here. Where's all my monsters? Where's all my ore? Where's all my iron? That's what we came here for. It's gonna be a little while longer before we have another mushroom day. Oh! I forgot you guys have a ranged attack. Fortunately, I am well protected against your nonsense. By this wonderful... Well, by these wonderful boots. Oh look, it's the coal sprites! Hello, coal sprites! Oh, I thought you were dead. Ah! Once again, gotta get reused to the combat. 
It is actually surprisingly difficult to tell where you can hoe. There's too much space around them. Did I find any ladder yet? I'm not sure that I did. I think maybe I didn't. Oh, I haven't finished exploring anyway. Get this iron. Oh, and there's my ladder. How convenient. I don't know, this might actually... Might be the last floor that I do. I don't seem to be having very much luck. I'll go down to the next one. Since it's available. Oh, we got some iron right here. Not having a super lot of luck finding the iron veins, those rich veins of iron ore. Might not be a lucky day. I don't check anymore. Because I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna- my plans are not gonna change depending on whether it says it's my lucky day or not. I've tried doing that and it never seemed to really make that big of a difference, to be honest. Oop. Oh, music, thank you. Anybody out there who is skilled at the creation of mods, make a mod that makes the music play all the time and just makes the music loop. Wah! Oh, I got I got bit. That's unrealistic. Bats don't usually. Well, I mean, bats can bite, but they don't commonly do it. Usually, I mean, bats are pretty chill. I think I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it a day in the mines. You go ahead and go to the Adventures Guild. Come on, Bima, let's save half a second here. Ooh, I'm getting a little framey here. I don't know if that's being picked up by, uh, by OBS. I hope you get, it, the quality is okay for you guys. And thermal boots. That's it. That is all. Let's also take a look at our progress here. A lot of slimes to go. I would really like to get a lot of slimes because that's when we get that ring that stops them from sliming us. Void spirits, bats, skeletons. Cave insects are done. Duggies, that's it. Have I claimed my reward? Oh, I get an insect head. Um, I don't want it. You keep that. You hold that for me, alright buddy? It's very cool looking. But it's not, you know, it's not great as a sword. Um, debating over going on the, the minecarts to go down, but... And you know what? It's probably too late to, to find Elliot. I don't think he usually goes to the pub. Well, on Friday nights, there are more people in the pub. We'll go and check. And we'll go and check on the beach. If we missed him, then we missed him. For some reason, I don't see myself losing a lot of sleep over missing Elliot's birthday. I know I'm supposed to try to make friends with everybody, but do I have to make friends with him? Slime Hunter. I'm not likely to go back down there. Certainly not to that level. All right, let's see if we've got an Elliot in here. Uh, I don't see one. Let's just go talk to everybody. And I'm not going to read everything because... Doesn't notice that I'm there. Poor Marnie. You have a kitchen in your house. Cook. Yeah, I do have a kitchen. Pam. Gus, what's up? Oop. Defending myself against Emily. Pity it'll soon be over. You know what? It's the fifth of fall. Be so negative. Sheesh. Okay, some of these guys have really repetitive uh, dialogue. Do need to give this guy a gift. Don't you have work to do? <sighs> so unappreciative. Talk to these folks over here. Get the teens. Abigail. Abigail, who was very cool. I have already given her two presents, though, so we don't need to do that again. Oh, here's Clint. How you doing? Depressing. A lot of very depressed people in the small town, which, to be fair, not unrealistic. At all. Small towns can be depressing. I grew up in one. So it's unlikely that I'm going to catch Elliot down here. I think he's probably inside, and I don't think I'm good enough friends with him to get in there. Nah. So, so much for that. Uh, let's get our crab traps here. Crab pots, sorry. I remembered, I remembered. And do you know what I forgot, friends? 
Uh, I forgot my fishing rod. I don't know why I thought I wouldn't need it. I'm gonna have to run home. I don't know, by the time I run home... It might be a little late to be going fishing for sea cucumbers. I usually try to leave the beach by 11. To make sure I get home in plenty of time. By the time I get all the way home... In the quiet of the night... The crickets chirping... Well, maybe I can do it. Ah, just trying to get the bait. I'm gonna handle everything else later. Just gonna grab my fishing rod. And since the game is paused, might as well throw some stuff in here. Alright, I'll take care of the rest later. Let's see if we get any luck tonight. I probably should have left the mines a little bit sooner. But I didn't. Oh well. Just gonna have to make do. I'll we'll probably get like maybe an hour of fishing. Eh, maybe a little less than an hour of fishing. Which, it's, it can be enough. I might get lucky. There we go, it's 10 p.m. It's probably gonna be 10 past by the time we get down here, but that is okay. We'll fish as much as we can. And then head home. So. Fish! We'll probably catch a few. Oh, look at that. We got our first piece of trash. Very exciting. What else are we gonna get? What else are we gonna get? Seaweed! Also good. Need that to make those those delicious maki rolls. Give us some energy when we have a, a full-on mining day. There we go. Lumberjacking. What do we got? Oh, oh. We got some treasures, what we got. And it's an albacore. Okay. Albacore is good too. And a piece of paint. Well, that fish was free. I'm telling you, how many times have I gotten those treasure chests lately and I just had bait in them? It feels like that happens really frequently. I still want my dinosaur egg. I'm still, like, fingers crossed for my dinosaur egg. Ooh, 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 ooh. Maybe this one is the dinosaur egg, guys. Maybe this is it. Maybe today's the day. Got an anchovy and... Prehistoric tool. Okay, well, that is still an artifact we didn't have yet. It's not a dinosaur egg, but it's something. We're getting closer. Oh, it's after 11 p.m. All right, last fish. Let me head home. Come on, fishy fishies. Give me something good. Give me something good. Be a sea cucumber. I don't know what your fish, your your pattern is, so I don't know if that's it or not. It's just another albacore, but that's all right. Albacore are fairly valuable, I think. We can sell those for some cash money. We always need more cash money. Hi, Willie. And give him a present. Not everyone gets a present every day. You know? People people have come to expect that I just give them stuff all the time. That's not fair. It's taking advantage of me. It's getting late. I know it's getting late. That's why I'm going home, game. Don't worry about it. I got it covered. Alright, Bemo. Stay there. We are gonna sell. We'll sell the jade. We'll sell the topaz. I think we can sell the cockle, and the shrimp, and the albacore, and the anchovy. Not sure how many frozen tears we have. I'm gonna keep everything else for, for my own personal use. And we're gonna throw some trash into the recycling machine. The rest in here. And... We didn't get too much iron ore, but we got some. Better than nothing. Put this prehistoric tool here so I don't forget to bring it to the museum. This is the foraging one, right? Okay. And seaweed needs to go in the fridge. And there's just one more thing I need to do before we run into bed. Hopefully I don't get that energy penalty. Gotta close this. There we go. Don't want my little chicken getting cold at night. This very fragile little guy. Awesome! So, I think we accomplished quite a lot today. Did a lot of things. And, yeah, it was pretty productive. We did not give Elliot a birthday present. Somehow, not gonna lose any sleep over it. Ready? Ready? I'm gonna prove it. Ready? Watch. Sleeping. Done. Oh, we leveled up foraging! So, axe proficiency, and we can now make a rain totem. I think those take us to the beach, which is handy. I should probably make some of those totems. I usually don't bother with them, but actually they're pretty handy and they save a lot of time. 
Okay, we made a little bit of money today. Not too, too much, but that's okay. We'll make most of our money probably when uh, we harvest the crops down there, when the, when the cranberries start coming in. So, that is it for today. Thank you very much for joining me and Orist here on Bashed Helmet Farm. I hope to see you tomorrow, which will be next week. And if you liked the video today, go ahead and click the thumbs up button. If you didn't like it, go ahead and click the thumbs down button. If you have anything to say, any feedback, any comments, just to say hi, go ahead and leave a comment below. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye!